During the Tom Brady roast, Bill Belichick got absolutely destroyed, but he is getting the last laugh. I am the DA. And I'm James the Greek. And this is Man Cave Sports. James, what is going on? Um, have you heard about Bill Belichick's girlfriend? Absolutely. And from a Jets fan who used to hate Bill Belichick, I got to say, I think he might be the GOAT. He might be better than Brady. He might be better than uh, Parcells. He's my new favorite, you know, football guy. Dude, this is um, it's an interesting one. And we're going to discuss it here today on Man Cave Sports. We're going to discuss Bill Belichick and his 23-year-old Jordan Hudson girlfriend um bill belichick 72 by the way and it is revealed that he is dating this 23 year old brunette um cheerleader um overall young person i don't know what the right say way to say it but we're finding out um in the best way possible that bill belichick is very spry and he is uh, apparently he is not the grumpiest man in the world some girl likes him out there so it has come out and uh, there's some great stuff some ring footage bill bill belichick walking out of her house shirtless like we've all done before uh on ring footage but we are finding out that bill belichick 72 49 year old d- older than jordan hudson they have been dating secretly, quietly since 2022. James, what is your first thought on this? What is your initial in your heart thought of Bill Belichick, the man you have hated for years and years and years, still just one upping every one of you Jets fans? So my first thought when I heard about this was, God, Bill Belichick is going to have the opportunity for another endorsement. Viagra endorsement. Here we go. It's time. Oh. Are you a Viagra man or Cialis man? Have you tried them? I've only tried it once. I tried Viagra once. It really didn't make any difference to me. But yeah, I, I guess if I was going to say I was a Viagra guy that one time, you know, I've never really had that problem though. Ah, it's not necessarily ever a problem, but it's fun. It's fun either way, dude. It's a great time. It's a great weekend. Let's just put it that way. It's a full... Anyways. Anyways. Everyone's making the Viagra jokes. Um, Joy Bear on... Um, the view on that horrible show uh making viagra jokes about bill belichick as if he can't get it up as if he's a uh he's just an old man i guess maybe she knows from experience being with old guys i have to say this let's get uh, let's back step this just a little bit with this is fun this is great but uh they met in 2021 on a flight okay they're flying i don't remember where they're flying but boston was one of the one of the places but they're on a flight sitting next to each other had a conversation, just kind of started it up, started a conversation. Bill Belichick at the end pulled Derek Jeter, signed her uh, textbook, her college textbook, and sent her off on her merry way. But that kind of started the interest, started the conversation. I don't know personally how it started after that, how text or whatever. <laughs> so they ended up getting going, getting dating, and now it's out there. So let me ask you this, James. It's out there. They're, they're dating. Do you care? Should we care? That, that he is dating a 23-year-old. Uh, no, of course not. Because it's very transparent what's going on. And anybody who can't see what's going on is an idiot. This girl, Jordan, wants someone who is going to take care of her, take her to great places, spend money, be famous for absolutely no reason. And Bill Belichick, on the other hand, is saying, oh, look at this. I can get in the sack with a 23-year-old that other 70 year olds can't so it's a mutual understanding of what they want it's not as if bill belichick is going to be showing up at her college and going to a kegger it's not like they have all those things dude could you imagine could you imagine you're at you're at a kegger you're at i'm I'm down at rice we're at nod we're at a party and i'm 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 getting a beer with bill belichick we're talking we're shooting the shit then he's like oh dude i gotta go man my girlfriend's calling my girlfriend's yelling at me and some girl in the back's like bill let's go you've had enough to drink let's go and he's like all right <laughs> and he's like peace out with a ring with like the super bowl ring <laughs> they're playing quarters for super bowl rings he's <laughs> leaving his ring falls off he's like oh it happens all the time it just kind of like hands he, or- it to you like oh we hold this <laughs> He tells her, honey, hold on one second. I got to do one more bong rip before we go. <laughs> There's a cannonball. Yeah. Uh, 
And, Great and I'm time. sure she wants to go to all of Bill's AARP meetings. She wants yes. to know what the perfect consistency Great of mush his food has to be. You know, they have something very special. <laughs> you know, they if they ever have a child, she'll be able to change both of their diapers. It'll be nice. So for so much of me, I wanted to debate this and, and say, I wanted to just lie to myself and say I'm disgusted by this, but I'm not. I'm not at all. I wanted to have a little back and forth. I wanted to have a little like give and take. I can't lie to myself enough. I'm not Stephen A. Smith. I can't lie to myself and make up some some lie to you. I am completely in favor of this. And I actually, I don't think she's a bad person. I don't think she's a gold digger. I don't think she's after his money. I don't think she's after fame because the one thing I've noticed She's not flaunting it. She's not talking about it. She's not out there spreading it. She's not showing it. She's not Instagramming it. She's not really doing anything. They've been dating for two years and we didn't even know about this. Ooh. To me, that's showing that somebody, it's not about the fame. Now it might be about the power. It might be about the fun. It might be about taking trips and stuff. I'm not going to say that. And I, I can't speak to her personally on that, but at least it's not about the fame. And I like that. They actually found out, I think it was TMZ or, or Telegram or reporter, who, who knows what it was. But she dated a 64-year-old guy before this. Some businessman, some nobody. So that tells me, and he defended her. It's like, hey, dude, like, let them be. Let them just do their thing. That she somehow, she there's something innate in her where she's relating in, in a, a whatever way to older men. And the older men are obviously relating her. I don't think the older men have any issue with it. But also, like, let's not forget, you're 64, you're 72. You don't, like, it's fun for the sex, but... Like to actually hang out with a 23 year old is not like I'm 42. I don't want to go hang out with a 23 year old all day long. That's not fun to me. Like that's, that's a different world. Like that world's past, right? I want the sex would be great, but you don't want to hang out with them 24 seven. That's a different, there, there's a different world there and they don't want to be hanging out with you, but something is making her like these older men and the older men somehow are actually drawn to her more than just banging, right? They want to actually chill with them. No, no, and no. There isn't anything more than just wanting to bang her. That's why they're hanging out with her. And you're talking about not wanting to hang out with the 23 year old. You know what the beauty is if you're 73 and you hang out with a 23 year old? You just turn down the volume on the, um, <laughs> the, the hearing what do you call it? Clear? Yeah, the, the clear. hearing aid, turn it down. You can't hear her anymore. It's done. Oh man, I just, good for him. You know what? Good for Bill. Like, I'm going to give it a round of applause. Give him a round of applause to Bill Belichick, to the man, the myth, the legend. The one we all thought was just miserable all the time. It's just laughing behind our backs. It's just it's just laughing at us. Do you like my light, yeah, by the way? You, it's like tweaking out on me. You know what the <laughs> best part of this is? You remember at the roast when Tom Brady and Belichick had that warm embrace Guess what? Bill probably leaned over and said, Tom, I'm so proud of you. Congratulations. You made $25, $30 million off of this deal. But my girl is still younger than the girls you get. So suck it. I'm the goat. Now imagine this. This is the thing about it. Like if, oh man, it was out. Like that. I think they would have torn him apart more. If they, if they knew he was dating her or like it was more out there and apparent as it is now, I think they would have tore him, Bill Belichick, even more. But they're talking about the ring, ring camera, like which was great. But I think they would have gotten him out more. But let us know what you guys think. Let us know if, if, if you think he's the GOAT for doing this or do you think it's a weird, that he's just a weirdo for dating somebody 49 years older than him. Let us know. Leave us a comment and we will fight. And then and, and, and if you really feel like it, just post a bunch of pictures of uh, Jordan Hudson too. Like, we're okay with that. Like, it's so gross. Just keep posting them pictures, all right? So but leave us some comments. Let us know what you think. Let us know what uh, what, what it's out there and if we're completely wrong or not, which we're not. But let us know what you think if we're wrong or not. And uh, make sure you leave us a like.